what is going on guys? I am Black Ops Amazing. Welcome back to another Zombies video where this Easter egg in Blood of the Dead has finally been finished, or at least that's what I believe. There are five different images that you can find around the map. These, I believe, are drawn by Albert Arlington or the Weasel, simply because, well, we know he is the artist. You can find his comic book within the map. He is the only character we know that draws things, and so it would only make sense for these to be related to him. It would only make sense for him to have done these. But like I said, there are five that you can find around the map. The very first one was found a couple of days after this map released. I couldn't begin to tell you who found it first as far as credit goes. However, I do know that Glitching Queen and her team actually finished this off. Five in total have been found. It seems like this is all of them, but of course I'm not 100% and if you do want to know how you can actually find these around the map for yourself, they're pretty simple. However, you do need to use your different special weapons on different items. Then you can check out that video, but getting into them, taking a look at the first one, we've all seen this before. It is the drawing of Ultimus Richtofen. We can clearly tell this is him by his face, his clothing and the hat that he's wearing. And then behind him, we have the text, who the hell are you? Now, this is strange because... First off, like I said, these are drawn by the weasel. It would only make sense for them to be done by him. As far as we know, he's never come into contact with Ultimus Richtofen. And also, why is Ultimus Richtofen in Blood of the Dead? I would assume this has taken place in Alcatraz. And for the weasel to have drawn this, he must have seen it, which means at some point, he's got to have come in contact with Ultimus Ricked often. But if you look through the Canorium or any bits of the storyline, this has never been brought up. Without this image, we wouldn't know this happened. And in fact, it doesn't even make sense. We do know in Classified, which takes place after Blood of the Dead, Primus Richtofen meets up with Ultimus Richtofen in Area 51. But as far as we know, he's never met up with Arlington. However, this image says otherwise. Clearly, the weasel doesn't know who he is. He's never seen him before because he's saying, who the hell are you? Unless it's Richtofen that's saying that. But that is the first one. I don't want to talk too much about this one since we've all seen it before. The next drawing of Arlington's is of Brutus. Of course, this one makes sense. In my opinion, it's a pretty pointless one. Arlington's seen Brutus. He's drawn him. I don't really know why this is in the game. The third image is quite interesting. There are a bunch of zombies with their hands in the air, and then we have the seagull above them. What exactly this is representing, or supposed to be showing, I'm not too sure. We know that the seagull helps our premise characters to escape off Alcatraz. Maybe the zombies are wanting its help to escape. We know that the zombies on Alcatraz are souls that have been trapped here, and at the end of the easter egg, when we break the cycle, they are finally freed. Maybe they are wanting the seagull to help them. Although again, that seems a little bit far-fetched because they're brainless, mindless zombies. But then the last two images which go together, the first one is this. In the background, we have San Francisco, the Golden Gate Bridge. There is the seagull in the sky, and then there is a person on a boat either rowing towards San Francisco or going towards Alcatraz. It's quite difficult to tell. It looks like he might be going to the prison just because of how he's rowing backwards. And then the second image, this time around there are two people in the boat and it looks like they are leaving Alcatraz. But again, I'm not really too sure what this is supposed to be telling us. In the first image, there's one person in a boat going towards Alcatraz. And then the second image, there's two people in the boat and it looks like they're leaving Alcatraz. It seems like someone has picked a prisoner up or whoever it is. They've picked them up from the island and are taking them back to the city. And then like I said, there's the seagull there. But who exactly these people in the boat could be? If you take a closer look at them, it doesn't look like a character of significance. It doesn't look like one of the prisoners, the mob of the dead crew or our premise characters. So it's really strange. And as far as we know, neither the mob of the dead crew or premise took a boat to Alcatraz. The premise crew actually teleported here. So as to who this could be, who these two people are, I'm honestly not too sure. There's going to be a reason as to why Treyarch added these in and took the time to create these drawings. Like I said, the only one that I think is pointless is the one of Brutus. But as for the others, the one with Ultimus Richtofen and these two of people going towards and from Alcatraz, I can't explain them. Maybe you guys could try in the comments section below or see what ideas and theories you could come up with. But it is definitely interesting. And again, if it's Arlington that's drawn these, then he must have seen this or 
been involved with it in some way, which can make you think, is this Arlington? If he's drawn this image, clearly he's been involved or seen it, so could this be him on the boat? Could this represent him being the odd one out? Him being the only one to leave the island? Because we know in the Mob of the Dead easter egg, there are two different endings. One where you continue the cycle, which is where the mobsters kill the weasel and events just continue. However, you can break the cycle where the weasel gets revenge and kills the other mobsters, meaning the loop is broken. And if the loop's broken, wouldn't Arlington then be free to leave? And could that be what this image is showing? Could this be the broken cycle representing the weasel finally leaving purgatory on Alcatraz after breaking the cycle, being the odd one out. And also, if you kind of zoom in, actually, it looks like one of the characters is wearing a scarf, and we know that the only character that wears a scarf, the one notorious for it, is the weasel. Could this be representing him leaving the island? Has someone come to pick him up? It's a strange one, and actually, could the person who's picking him up be Ultimus Richtofen? <laughs> um, maybe not, or... Possibly this is something for the future. Maybe this will all make sense in a future DLC. But it's definitely something to think about. So let me know your thoughts down below. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. It was a short one. Like I said, drop a like rating. Make sure you are subscribed. And I'll see you all in the next video. Until then, goodbye.